ever wondered if the internet is a safe haven for knowledge and connection or a dangerous jungle fraught with threats? Well, it's a bit of both. The internet, like a coin, has two sides. On one hand, it's a treasure trove of information, a platform for creativity and a hub of global connection. On the other, it harbors risks like cyberbullying, misinformation and privacy breaches. It's all about how we use it. Understanding this dual nature is the first step to navigating the digital world safely. In this digital jungle, what are the threats that we need to be wary of? As we venture deeper, we find the undergrowth teeming with perils. Cyberbullying, for instance, is a dark beast that lurks in the shadows, targeting the vulnerable and spreading venomous words. Then we have phishing, a sly predator that tricks us into revealing our personal details under the guise of security. Further along, we encounter the shapeshifter, identity theft. It steals your digital persona, leaving you stranded and confused. And let's not forget the cunning online scams, the digital equivalent of a trap set by a seasoned hunter waiting to ensnare the unwary. But perhaps the most dangerous beast of all is inappropriate content, a chameleon that can appear harmless but has the potential to cause significant harm. And remember, the more personal information we share in this jungle, the more we become a beacon for these threats. Knowing the threats helps us to stay alert and take the necessary precautions. Now that we know the threats, how can we protect ourselves and our loved ones? The first line of defense is creating strong, unique passwords. Imagine your password as a lock on a door. A weak lock can be easily picked, while a strong lock provides much better protection. Use a mix of upper and lowercase letters, numbers, and symbols to make your password difficult to crack. And remember, every door should have a different lock, so avoid reusing passwords. Next, let's discuss privacy settings. Just as we wouldn't leave our front door wide open, we should not leave our online profiles exposed. Take the time to understand and adjust your privacy settings on social media and other online platforms. This helps control who sees your personal information and limits your exposure to potential threats. Now onto unsolicited communication. The internet is full of unsolicited emails, messages, pop-ups and advertisements. Many of these can be phishing attempts designed to trick you into revealing sensitive information. Be skeptical of these communications. As the saying goes, if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. Don't click on suspicious links and never give out personal information unless you're sure it's safe. Before sharing any personal information online, take a moment to think. Would you shout this information in a crowded room? If not, it's probably not something you should share online. Remember, once something is on the internet, it's nearly impossible to completely remove it. Lastly, parents play a crucial role in ensuring internet safety. It's important to educate children about potential online threats and how to handle them. Set rules for what is appropriate to share online and monitor their internet use. Remember, it's not about invading their privacy, but about keeping them safe. Implementing these safety practices can go a long way in keeping us safe in the digital realm. So, how can we ensure our journey through this digital jungle is safe? Let's take a moment to revisit what we've learned. We started by understanding that the internet can be both a safe haven and a dangerous jungle. It's a world of endless opportunities, but it's also a place where threats lurk around every corner. We then explored these threats in more detail, from cyberbullying to identity theft, from phishing scams to inappropriate content, we delved into the dark corners of the digital jungle. The threats are real, but they don't have to be intimidating if we know what to look for. Next, we discussed practical tips for internet safety. We talked about the importance of strong, unique passwords and the role of privacy settings. We stressed the value of thinking before you click and the necessity of keeping personal information private. We also highlighted that it's okay to ask for help when you're not sure about something online. But perhaps the most important message we shared is that internet safety is a shared responsibility. It's not just about protecting ourselves, but also about creating a safer internet for everyone. It's about being mindful of our actions and their potential impacts, and about fostering a culture of respect and kindness online. Remember, staying safe online is not just about protecting ourselves, but also about creating a safer internet for everyone. So let's make every day a safer internet day.